Oh, she's taking so many pictures. Okay, okay, okay. Before I get sidetracked and this out and this video ends up being three and fucking five hours long, I'm already gonna have to cut some of it up. Uh, instant film. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. Yeah, I'm gonna water this plant. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Oh. Think up. Oh my god, that was cute. This action will have consequences. What? How? All I did was water a plant. Quite literally, all I did was water a plant. A plant. I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. I feel like One all the decisions I've made so far collection. that will actually have consequences. I feel like I'll I've done them right. HD. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. I feel like I've done them right. Honestly, I feel like I've done them right. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey girl, borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Fantastic. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Hmm. I don't even know who the hell... Hang on. I am so addicted to this site. Mm. Look at these vintage beauties. I love how it's actually called... Okay. makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Okay, so Matt... So Warren does go to her college. Okay. Max, thanks. Oh, thanks for your email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also have a rather eclectic, uh, whatever the hell that says, collection of TV, cult, classic, and fucked up films on a fat flash drive. If you ever wanted to check them out, thanks again for the help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera... <laughs> can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? Be seeing you, Warren G. Okay. Besides anything... I want to see what's in here. <sighs> Max and Chloe. Best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Hmm. I wonder what happened between her and Chloe. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. <laughs> I was about to say, there's no point in leaving it on. There's no point in leaving it on when you left to begin with. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Okay, so Dana's in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Beautiful. Let me out, Julia. This is so Answer stupid. you what? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Can I talk to you? Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. Well, I'm sorry. What did, what did she do? What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Oh, ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? <laughs> Julia. Fuck. This bitch's last name. <laughs> I don't know this bitch's last name. I barely even remember that Julia, that Dana was her friend to begin with. <laughs> Julia. Okay, well, it's definitely not Olson. It's definitely not Olson. Patson, Mason, or Watson. It's definitely not Olson. Juliet Mason, Juliet Patson, Juliet Watson. I feel like. No, Mason. Juliet Mason. Uh, Juliet Mason. 
That was truly sad. Holy shit, Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, <sighs> Juliet Watson. You know something? In my head, when I said Juliet Watson out loud, I was like, you know what? Watson sounds right. Watson sounds like the most right out of all of these. Okay. Here. Skip. Oh, yes, Max. Skip. Juliet Watson. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would Dana do that? How do you know? Yeah, how do you know? She might tell us how she knows. Victoria Chase. You know her. You could say that. Uh huh. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Really? According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight I... to hell. Max, <laughs> I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Now, okay. Dana's gonna have I was about to say, I feel like... I feel like Victoria I... lied. I'm I really not letting do... her out until she tells the truth. Fine, fine, Victoria. I mean, Juliet. I'm gonna get these names messed up so much. So Dana said that the proof is probably in her room. Where the hell is her room? This is the showers again. Where the hell is Victoria's room? Victoria's gonna walk in here, see us in here. She's gonna be mad. No, but I'm wondering, like, I feel like Victoria lied on Dana, but, like, why would she do that, though? Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Really? Jesus. Uh-huh. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Hmm. The proof might be on her computer. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo and for this nice shot. Boom, this is the email I need to show Juliet. Yep. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Taylor is so sad to inform you that I totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention to Juliet that I saw a nasty sex from Dana on Zach's phone. Oh, uh, so she played both of them. Dumbass believes me, and so I expect there to be a dorm rampage soon. Juliet deserves this for slutting Zach away from me. As for Dana, who cares? Get your popcorn, XXVC. Oh, uh, so she was mad at Juliet. And then framed in. Damn, I'm a fucking Victoria. Literally, I was nice to her a minute ago. See, I should have been mean. I feel like, I feel like that's why. So like, how do I print, girl? Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Hell no. Gallery letter. Okay, no, no, no. So she doesn't have a printer in here. I kind of want to look at her shoes. Those boots are made for walking runways. Dior, Givenchy. You could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. I was, exp I was fully expecting her to be standing on the other side of the store. Okay, so. I thought I had a printer in here. Do I not have a printer? Have I lost my mind? Why did I think I have a printer in here? Warren no. makes me laugh. It's nice to feel Mother like you're Mother of frick! Made a okay. I don't think that plant did anything, you know? I think it's perfectly fine. Okay, so... Here's my problem. How on earth... Be the change you wish to see? This is Victoria's room. Let me go in her room. Let me go in Victoria's room. Go to this email. Oh wait, no, there was a- I'll give Victoria props for not posting my Shut photo. Up, Max. And for this nice shot. She does have a printer in here, I'm angry. Damn it. Give me this. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. She's gonna be standing right I keep expecting her to be standing right here waiting to leave. She's going to be like, why the hell are you in my room? Then 
Where the hell is our toilet paper on the ground? You know what? We're not talking about that. We're not going to talk about that. Juliet, here. Juliet, read Look this. Look at this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, <laughs> You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. <sighs> Okay, so I'm cool with Dana. I'm cool with Dana Almost and a done. tiny bit Get cool the flash with Victoria. Drive and then I'll go see Warren. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumbass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pussed out. If you need any money, let me know. Logan. Hmm. Weird. Whoever the hell... Oh, is this the flash drive? Yep, flash drive. Looks like a flash drive. Right? Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. That Thank is you. not a flash drive. <laughs> You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Dana, no! Dana, no. Okay. No, 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 no. Dana, I'm so sorry. Nice, Max. I don't you know. hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. Dana. I could rewind and make it up to her. Dana, I'm going back. Hell no. I didn't mean to be nosy. I didn't even know what that was. I still don't even know what that is. I thought it was a... I don't know what in me thought that looked like a flash drive. When it literally says... The, when the prompt of the flash drive is literally sitting right there in front of my face. Okay. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down <laughs> again. Shut the hell up, Golem. Oh, God. No, no. We are not being nosy on Dana. She likes us. We're pretty cool with her. Can I shut her door back? Or is this just not going to happen? Can I talk to her, actually? Dana? Hey, Dana. Dana! Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. I heard a rumor about you. Victoria is not nice. Gets a rage on. I heard a rumor. Dana. I don't I'm know what she's talking to be about. Nosy, but but hey. I heard a rumor about you. <gasps> what? She's pregnant. Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? Of course. 100%. Of course. I was pregnant. <sighs> Was. No. Oh. What about the other? Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. It's none of my business. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Oh my god, Dana. And she looks so pretty. She would be a great mom. I love her I love her shoes, by the way. I love her chucks. I can't believe I accidentally looked at <laughs> Y'all, I I did not know there was a pregnancy test. I don't know what in me Warren? I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count on the cars. The more I text, the longer I take on my way. Bye. I don't mind waiting out here forever, you know. You know. <laughs> All right, so we have to go back to, I think, the parking lot? Yeah, the lot, because he said the lot at first. I can't wait to meet this Warren dude in person. Well, not meet him, because she already knows him, but I don't. Fuck this shit. Huh? Ow! What just that happened? Hurt. Damn, I better rewind. Well, that was rude. That was so mean. What just happened? Are you okay? It looks like I get a headache when I do that. Hey, are you okay? Oh, wait, this get is lost, Zach. Hipster. I'm not- Fuck this shit. No! Not the hell it- Fuck this shit. Wait, does he oh, hit her shit. in the back of the head? Ow. The back of the head. Okay, I'm so confused. I 
I could almost feel sorry for him if he wasn't such a serious dick. Poor Fuck this shit. Are you freaking kidding me? Ow! That hurt. Get lost, hipster. No. Hold on. I have to talk to her. I have to talk to Allison. Hey, Alyssa, not Allison. Move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. He's gonna get in trouble for that window. By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Victoria, how did you even get my number? That's what I want to know. At least we have Victoria on our phone now, just in case we ever need her for some reason. Victoria, girl, that's what you get, though. That's what you get for playing games with people and their emotions. No, you shouldn't be doing that. Huh? What happened? So don't think I'm blind. I Kate? see everything here at <gasps> Kate! Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. I'm not taking a picture of that, Kate! Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Remember this finger that I'm about to flip. Move and leave Kate alone. She didn't even do anything. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I love Kate. She's so sweet and she's so nice. I felt so like nice. an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business? <sighs> I'm so mad at myself because right about now, I, I'm replaying what Kate said in my head just now. That seemed a tiny bit shady how she had to leave so goddamn fast. I... Mm, I don't know. I have no clue. I don't know. I'm kind of done with humanity right now. I, no, there's nothing I can do about that. There's not enough evidence against Kate for me to be able to actually want to go back and undo that. I can't prove that she did anything, and until then, she didn't do anything. Uh, now we have to go talk to Warren, the main point of the, this for the longest time. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. Hmm. I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Uh. Dang. I don't get it. How could Zach and Victoria do that to me? Juliet. Hi, Juliet. How, how are, are you, you feeling? Doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry about Zachary. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. Really? I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. You don't just sex somebody as a joke. I love how I ran into her by, by mistake. At least Rachel Amber has people who care about her. Yeah, there's so many posters of her all over the school. Hmm. I wonder if we'll, I hope we end up finding her. Like, by the end. Now this really pisses me off. So entitled. Sorry, handicapped folks. My truck needs these two spots more than you do. 
bastard. Oh, yeah. Ugh. I hate it when people do that in real life, too, because it's like, seriously? Really? You're like, oh my god, it's Yo, the famous Max, Warren. Check it out. Warren! What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. He went in for that. <laughs> check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. Uh, 1978 like to be car. exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. You really I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Hmm. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie video I could have been flash rude. Drive? I could have been rude. Um, wait, what did he just ask me? I think he asked me if I had time to check out the flash drive. No, I've no, been busy I've doing been things. No, I've been busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. Or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Seen it. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't want to say not at all, because she might be rude to him about it. You know what? No, not at all. Not at all. Sensitive is good. That's exactly what I wanted her to say. You have hip taste and a quick mind. Thanks for noticing, Max. The right girl will, too. If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk. I need to talk to somebody. Just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal? Now. Answer me, bitch! Uh, call me on my name. I'll I told him the, the truth. truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Hmm. I should call the police. I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! Ah! <laughs> oh! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Are oh, you gonna choke not my me? Parents, not the you're gonna choke me, Daddy! Right in now. the bathroom! <laughs> Let me stop. Let me stop. That was funny. Who the hell is driving up? Chloe? It, that's Thanks, Chloe? Chloe? You again. Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! What? Oh, get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Uh, Nobody! No, nah, but Warren, no. Uh, dang it. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. He just... This day never ends. He killed her oh, best friend. Oh, thanks, Chloe. The very first time. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. 
It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. If yes, we see her, kind of day. if we tell her what so happened, I feel like she's going to believe us. Uh, hopefully nothing. Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. <laughs> Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course. of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I wanted to. I wanted to. I was just so tripped out over leaving Arcadia. Oh, please. I'm sure your phone and laptop were frozen in time. You're merciless. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. I should have just said sorry. Mm. Come on. Talk to her. Chloe. I Me mean, not Chloe. Fucking Max. Broken. Huh? Man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has mm. a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Nerd alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage, and he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Oh, 